Well, here it is, another dark and dismal day across Cobb County. The streets are wet. It's been raining again. Streets have been flooding. There have been a scattered amount of problems across the county, and it looks like more rain may be moving in. We could get a substantial amount of rain between now and Thursday evening. So earlier today, a group of public safety leaders, our EMA director, deputy county manager, and the chairman all gathered to uh, discuss the situation and the potential for more flooding across the county, make sure that everybody is ready for what may be to come. Here's EMA Director Cassie Moslem. We met this morning and we were able to get a game plan together should we get more rainfall in the next couple of days, uh, looking at potential shelter sites if we need them, uh, going through making sure that the management team knows how to find the appropriate information on our county sites. And our DOT folks have been busting their tails throughout this entire wet period, clearing roads that have flooded. They had more than a dozen calls last night. And Road Maintenance Division Manager Dallas Kane says uh, they pretty much solved all the problems right now except for one. Right now we're dealing with isolated flooding issues throughout the county. Um, nothing major going on other than some roadway flooding due to catch basins being clogged and so forth. Um, but for the majority, all roadways are open except one where a private pond has been overflown, but we're working with the property owner to get that cleared up right now. No residents are affected at this time. If there's water settling in the roadway, don't take the chance of driving through it if it's more than a couple inches and you can't see the roadway. Um, it could be a hazard to you or anybody else. If you see issues that you think need to be reported, please report them to 911 or Cobb DOT directly so we can come inspect and handle as we see fit for the isolated areas. And if you don't have to be on the roadway, uh, like always, just don't be on the roadway. And you know, this is the internet age and Cobb County's got resources available. If you really want to follow along with the weather and the potential trouble spots, you can go to our emergency management page on CobbCounty.org. Click the hazards and mitigation tab and you'll find uh, locations that uh, show you the current weather and even stream gauges. You can see in real time how the uh, streams and uh, creeks around Cobb County are rising with the uh, approaching weather. They can go to that site and look uh, at exactly what we're going to look at. If you were to call me today, I'm going to look at that particular site to give you that information. So it's all right there under their fingertips. So stay tuned again until Thursday night. It could be a wet period here in Cobb County. And as you know, the ground is already saturated, which could lead to trouble happening quicker than you might expect.